Best Catcher's Bags. Number 5. Boomba Rolling Catcher's Super Pack 2.0. I would always recommend you to use a true catcher's gear bag as a catcher. But, sometimes, the aspects of the use, taste bud, and preference could be different. If you are determined to pick a bat pack instead of a professional catcher's bag, I would strongly recommend picking the Boomba Rolling Catcher's Super Pack 2.0. As a compact bat pack, it is a wheel bag along with heavy-duty wheels and a telescopic handle. These make rolling easy for the bag. On the other hand, two separate bat compartments allow you to carry up to four bats at a time in the bag. The main compartment with a removable flap will hold all necessary catcher's gear. The bottom side vented cleat compartment is designed to keep the cleats easily. Also, a small pocket on the surface to put personal things like phones and small gadgets. The reinforced J-hooks are implemented in this Boomba Rolling Catcher's bag. These are sturdy enough to hang your bag on the fence for a long time and make the bag as your portable locker. Pros implemented internal and external compartments can hold all your catcher's gear. Strong J-hooks are sturdy enough for long-time hanging. Can roll the roads and grasses. High quality and strong build make it durable. A bunch of multicolors is available. Cons highly preferred for youth baseball players. The adults would face some difficulties with professional features. Coming in number 4. Wilson Team Gear Bag. I have been talking about all premium catcher bags. Due to this reason, don't be bothered that there are no good bags under 100 bucks. The Wilson Team Gear Bag is here to fulfill your need for a duffel bag at a price tag under $100. You may face some inconvenience with using features and accessibilities in this bag. But, be assured that the carrying capability, durability, and quality, all are here to serve. I assure you that this bag will fulfill all your equipment carrying needs with proper space. Not just proper space, note that this bag actually has the biggest dimension on my list as well. Bats, mitts, leg guards, gloves, and chest protectors all have to be in the main compartment. By the way, you can take a maximum of two bats along with all gear inside the main compartment. There are two additional vented side compartments that could be used as the holder of wet training tools, helmets, or apparel. Also, this one has a removable and customizable panel which you can use embroidery to customize. Pros Larger Space Affordable price under $100. Multicolor options. Multiple price options. Vented side pockets for cleats, helmets, and wet apparel. Cons. No shoulder straps for backpacking. No specialized compartmentalization. Coming in number 3. Demarini Special Ops Frontline Wheeled Bag. Demarini always tries to give the best quality in terms of performance, design, and build quality. As a subsidiary of Wilson Sports Goods Manufacturer, I always rely on them for quality and trust. By the way, Demarini hasn't disappointed me here either. The Demarini Special OPS Frontline Wheeled Bag is another top player on my list. It could be on the top if the size is not compact. The bigger bag with a compact design, this is the short of this catcher's gear bag. Other catcher's bags, like Commander and Noe 2, the Demarini Special OPS is also a premium one with around 70% less margin, which is great actually. The bag is designed with an armored bat compartment that holds four bats at a time. The bat pack compartment also is used as the main compartment where you put other necessary equipment like chest protectors, mitts, gloves, and others. The middle compartment is used as the shelf of the catcher's helmet, and the bottom one is for the cleats. The cleat compartment is breathable that keeps proper airflow on. There are six exterior pockets that could be used for any other necessary tools. There are two integrated fence hooks that could turn your bag into a portable locker. The hard body construction distributes the load all over the bag and two bottom support rails enhance the hardness as well. Two inline wheels and a telescopic pull handle are here to significantly reduce your effort to carry the bag. The bag travels smoothly on grasses, roads, and anywhere. It is a true competitor to the Commander and E2 with its great build quality, space, and performance. Pros The armored bat compartment holds four bats. The vented cleat compartment keeps the shelf airflow on and clear. 
The telescopic handle and inline wheel ensure smooth rolling of the bat. Two integrated fence hooks help to hang the bag with ease. The bag is preferable for all ages. Heavy-duty fabric and hard body construction make the bag highly durable and the best bag in its price segment. Cons. I have found nothing yet. Coming in number 2. Boomba Rolling Catcher Super Pack Hybrid. The first two bags that we have discussed are top high-end baseball softball wheeled catcher's bags. But, you may be asking about a price-optimized wheeled bag that can fulfill all your needs. In this criteria, I would love to talk about the Boomba Rolling Catcher Super Pack Hybrid. Because I would be pretty comfortable spending in a cost-effective way on catcher's bags if my kids are just starting to learn baseball, or for a casual hobbyist baseball player. By the way, if I am asked about the bag to answer in short, I would say, it is a perfect bag for youths. This bag is significantly cheaper than the premium Noe 2 and the Bonnet Commander. But, still, you will get almost the necessary space and performance from this one. The most fantastic feature of this bag is its hybrid carrying system. As the name shows, this one implies a shoulder strap to carry on your shoulder. Or, just roll the wheels on the road as well. So, no worries you are tired, or just have style, both will be insured with its hybrid carrying. The side compartments are just pretty to keep your bats and shin guards. You can put up to four bats on the outside of the bag in two compartments. In this case, the shin guards could be put inside the bag. Also, you can keep two bats and leg guards on the two outer compartments. The three compartments in the main body are designed to keep the other catcher's gear like chest protectors, catcher's helmets, batting helmets, nets, cleats, and so on. The nylon material of the bag is super durable to carry out heavy loads. The telescopic pull handle is just easy to pull. The bag is also in good shape and size with a dimension of 23.5 by 13.5 by 9.5 inches. No issues with the goods you want to carry. Just keep your equipment and apparel and move around the regions. Pros The hybrid system gives you two types of carrying systems, this will give you great relief to pull the wheel when tired. Also, you can use it as a backpack with style. The Boomba Rolling Catchers allow you up to four bats to carry. This is even more than the Bunette Commander Catcher Bag. A wheel bag at a comparatively cheaper price allows you to keep all your catcher's gear in the same place. Customizable with several colors. Cons. Not preferred for the full-sized equipment and professional baseball players. Not that top-notch quality. Coming in number one. No Errors No E2 Catcher's Bag No Errors is a specialized brand that makes premium bags for baseball softball. Errors No E2 Catcher's Bag is the most premium and highest quality catcher's gear bag from No Errors. By the way, it is also the most expensive catcher's bag on my list as well. A lot of counterparts are in the market, yet I have chosen this one on the top with a number of researches. Let's first discuss its material. The Errors No E2 Catcher's Bag is made of heavy-duty fabrics. It ensures the ultimate durability along with great construction. The bag has six compartments that feature nine pockets for it. Let me explain the compartments and the pockets. The main compartment has three parts, upper, middle, and lower. In the upper one, you can put your catcher's helmet. The middle one is for the catcher's mitt and chest protector, and the bottom one is for the batting helmet. Underneath the center compartment, the compartment you see can put your baseball bats. It is compatible to hold up to four bats at a time. The left side is designed individually to put the shin guards with knee savers. Basically, the shin guards get dirty fast. So, a solo compartment specially for the shin guards will save your other gear from dirt. On the other side, a heavy-duty cleat pocket is placed to keep your cleats. Near the center compartment, another two pockets are placed to keep wet gear like batting gloves and balls. These pockets are vented. In the center's middle compartment part, another pocket is designed so that you can keep your wet jersey or other clothes. By all means, the Errors No E2 Catcher's Bag is highly durable with heavy-duty materials and reinforced stitching. This wool bag is designed to keep all your equipment in one place with easy access. It also has four fence hooks to hang the bag on the fence. 
The rugged Fatboy wheel is one of the most significant features that allow you to roll the wheels in any type of terrain. Pros enough space to keep the equipment. The rugged Fatboy wheels are capable of bearing the bag in harsh tracks. Highly durable materials. Three ventilated pockets keep the bag clean. You can turn it into a mobile locker by hanging it with the hooks. Cons. The premium price range, which is expensive. There is no pulling handle.